when we talk about sex differences in thermoregulation, there are definite differences. Women will what we call vasodilate or their all their blood vessels will open up and bring heat to the surface first when they're hot. And there's a significant amount of blood change that goes to coming to the surface. With that, if a woman goes into a sauna, she's going to absorb heat a lot faster and she's going to get more of a thermal stress from that. But she won't start to sweat immediately because her body's used to changing core temperature because that happens over the course of the menstrual cycle. We have around a one degree Fahrenheit change between our low hormone and our high hormone. So our body's used to shifting its thresholds to understand that increased thermal load. Where a man will go in and they'll vasodilate and start sweating. And as soon as they start sweating, they start losing a lot of the body water and their core temperature will come up a lot faster than a woman. So they're not as comfortable, so they don't need to have as long a time in the sauna to get a change. 